just shut up and listen. <laughs> and listen good shit. <laughs> All right, hello there, and welcome back to another episode of Michigan Report from Hell. Uh, we're going, I think, back to our office again for some fucking reason. As I've said in previous installments, this game has stopped making sense a long time ago. We're just fucking... They had, like, a laundry list of places to go hey, to, and they were, we're like, yeah, let's go to here, here, here. <laughs> we Nina was killed last night. I thought she was fighting it from I'm the really inside. Grateful to her. I wonder if we could have saved her. That seemed like a canon cutscene death, though. We arrived at the main headquarters of Zaki TV. We're here. Haven't we already been here? The I swear to God we went too. here. As soon as we got we to the chief's floor, some monsters, so watch we out. began filming. I swear to God we've been here before. Because didn't we see, like, the yearbook or whatever? That... Oh, hey. Anne. Risco. So you're all right. Thank goodness. Yeah. A lot of stuff happened, but we're still alive. Good to see you're all right, too. How were things at home? My whole family had already evacuated, but I'm worried about Jonesy. He wasn't there. Jonesy? Yes, our cat. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I bet your family took him with them. Yeah, that's pretty... So what about the chief? Pretty obvious. Did you already talk to her? Why would they leave a cat no, that'd be fucked up? not yet. Say, Briscoe. I'm sorry. I've been so hard on you. I feel really bad about it now. Nah, don't worry about it. I was to blame too, you know. Well, let's go inside. I don't know, she was kind of being a bitch. Okay, now. <laughs> We've got to film, yeah, let's we've got to really film these the people's death. Are you okay, we've Frisco? Really gotta let her You're gonna know gonna fucking hit no me with that. Certain terms. <laughs> the teams go through hell out there when we're covering the news. What? Especially this time. He's fucking... Why are you spitting the it like that? You're gonna hit somebody, dude. Advisory, but she sent us out anyway. A lot of our colleagues have disappeared. Some of them are even dead, like Pamela. I'd like to make that damn chief go through the same thing poor Pamela went through. Yeah. And you know what else? She'd better make damn sure she doesn't go exposing any more of us employees to danger. And she'd better let the ones who are left evacuate. I'm gonna make her promise. Where's goes fucking going you ham? Get it all Look on at tape, him. All right? Oh my fucking. Okay, good. Wait, it looks like I wasn't capturing the mouse. Good. Hope not. I have a bad habit of that when it comes to emulation. I did the same shit when I was playing for through Final Fantasy VII. Although I never. Yup. Oh shit! I skipped it. Go it. Fire! Another Not one back here. Bad, huh? Oh no, we're good. Yeah, baby. God. You I skipped did it. it. I skipped the scene, but I think it was just her uh, yelling monsters. Probably. That's fine. I got shit. It's just broken down. Why would anyone be in this building? Like it's structurally unsound. Okay, let's go. <laughs> go through Briscoe there, that's fine. Whoa! Sexy beam? <laughs> HTTP... Oh, is that a real website? <laughs> Hold on. Obvi obviously, it's not the same website there, but I just want to see... Oh, that's probably gonna be malware. Okay, so, uh... That is 100% a virus website. They wanted me to install an extension when I went there, so I would advise you to not go to that website. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's adware. Or 
malware, one of the two, spyware, something like that. Filing cabinet. Nothing in it looks especially useful. Okay, is that going to be... That's probably going to be all the same. All right. Hey, it's many important looking documents or not. Whatever. Picture there. A mouse. <laughs> a rat? No, it's a mouse. Is it in the mouse spot? Do you get it, everyone? There's a new message on the answering machine. It seems to be from Robbie Adonis. I don't know who that is. That's probably a famous person or something. It's coffee. It's ice cold now. Oh, is that suspenseful? That's... Alright, whatever. Who do you suppose painted this? Not signed. All these, like, random-ass, like, nothing... Okay, whatever. Let's continue on. So the chief's in there, huh? Okay, let's go in. All right. Let's see this. Excuse me. And turn around, I'm she's gonna be a zombie. Anderson. Oh, she's alive. What's going on? What's this disturbance? A voice. Hmm. And a camera, too. What's the meaning of this? We have something very important we want to talk to you about. Oh, you do, do you? And what might that be? A sultry voice. Well, you see... Hey, what's the matter? Go ahead and tell her! Me? It was your idea, Briscoe. <laughs> Speak no one actually now. wants to do this. It's your job to communicate, isn't it? Oh, yes. Yes, of course. Look, Briscoe, I can't do this. <laughs> when she looks at me, my heart starts pounding. Oh, I didn't know I you were like that, Anne. Out. Okay. What? Hmm. Could that old rumor be true? The one about the chief having uh, special relationships with What the fuck? <laughs> Pamela denied it. What are you two whispering about? You're being very rude, you know. Hmm. Uh, all right. Fine. Why is she leaning like that? I'll what the say fuck? It then. Posture Listen, is insane. She... Hmm. Let's see. Your name was Briscoe, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yes. Uh, that's right. <laughs> Briscoe. Back down real quick. Gee, you know my name? Wow, I'm honored. You have a reputation for doing fine work out in the field. You're the number one candidate for this year's Flair Award. Uh, am I really? And of course, I've been thinking about a suitable oh, here we go. for you. Okay. Wow. Uh, thank you very much, ma'am. Now, wait just a minute, Briscoe. Have you forgotten all about Pamela? Oh! Right! Of course! <laughs> Instantly shouting. Now, listen here, Chief. You deliberately ignored the government's evacuation advisory. You demanded that the news teams go out and cover stories. You unnecessarily put their lives in jeopardy. I never demanded that the teams do anything. Just shut up and listen. <laughs> and listen good, Chief. <laughs> what the I, fuck is John that? Philip Briscoe, say this as a representative of all Zucker doing a rap? news teams. We refuse to get kicked around anymore. <laughs> my, my. This is fascinating. <clears throat> do go on. So this is what you're gonna do, Chief. 
Uh. Find out what happened to every single news team member that disappeared. And make sure we all get safely evacuated. You're going to do these things, and you're going to do them right away. You got that? And you're going to apologize to and compensate the families of the team members who died. I want you to promise you're going to do these things right here in front of this camera. There's no need for that. It's like... <laughs> All those things have already been taken care of. Like you did joke takes. Oh. And then have? they used the joke takes of the but, voice act. Hey, wait just a minute. Show me you're taking this seriously. Don't delegate these things to your staff. I want you to take care of them personally. Briscoe, let me share something with you. Five hours from now, there'll be a military rescue transport at the airport. That's the military. Do you hear me? I negotiated for this with General Sanders personally, you see. Now, I hope you're beginning to understand. Oh, I see. A military transport, you say? Well, that's great. I guess somebody as important as you would have lots of high-level connections like that. Gee, I... Well... So, Briscoe, would you like to be on that transport? Well, sure. Of course. You want to get out of here? Yes. Uh, I'll do anything. Well, then I have a little favor to ask. Oh, here we go. We're going to report some other shit. Favor, ma'am? What is it? One of our men is being held in detention in a certain place. Held in detention? What for? Please, don't ask. The That's man's name is fuck. Glenn Buckland, I believe. With the confusion of the evacuation advisory, I'm afraid he was left behind, still locked up. We just can't leave him there now, can we? I'd like you to go rescue him. Mm, okay. You want to make sure every single employee is all right. Isn't that what you said? Well, yes. Yes, of course. So, where is this guy being held? In a research room at the Von Erich Library. A research room a research in a library? Room at the library. Got it! The fuck's we'll a get research him out room? And as I'm sure you've realized, this could be a big scoop. Library has a you research know, room. A dramatic rescue scene. That, that must be a mistranslation. Make sure you get it all on tape. And as for your report... Yes, ma'am. Your work hasn't been quite up to snuff lately. Ooh, getting told off. A news reporter has to be professional and accurate at all times, you know. Ooh, yikes. I'm very sorry, ma'am. A pro never makes excuses for herself. Take the chance you're given and get it right. This next report will be your moment of truth. Yes, ma'am. I'll do my best. How did this get turned you around so quick? We were going to tell her off and then like... Very well. That will be all. We're doing something for her now. Yes, ma'am. She threatened to Thank not you. evacuate us, technically. Excuse us then, ma'am. That was just a mess hey, of a Brisco. scene. What the heck was that in there? Yeah. I don't know what happened. Oh, God damn it. it. Every fucking episode. It was like I couldn't go against her, you uh -oh. know? Didn't you feel the same way? Yes, I guess I did. I don't know why, but... There we go. She makes me want to give her the best report ever, even if it means risking my own life. Y yeah me too. Let's go do this thing then. Yes, let's go. To the library. You'll drive, won't you, Briscoe? Sure! Sure! Okay. 
Look at the difference in points there. What the fuck? Like, <laughs> I got the one E thing in the whole fucking, the whole map. And it only gave me 10 points compared to 5,000 suspense points. How am I, how are you ever supposed to get the E or like, well, immoral, you could just brute force it by like knocking people over. But how are you ever supposed to get the erotic ending? That doesn't, I don't know if that's possible. Okay, well, whatever. Let's save here, and we're going to end it off here. I, I, I have to go and turn off my window sound. I keep forgetting every time I stop recording, and I should probably get that done so it doesn't a big-ass noise. People probably freaking out watching the video, and windows noises are going off. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, that whole scene with, with the chief was just a fucking... I was something else. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I'm 100% sure that had to have been a joke take. There's no reason for him to be like, he was almost sing-songy when he was like doing it. Like, I'm not going to take it NMO. Like, what, what was that? Okay. Well, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like and comment below. If you want more of my stuff, make sure to dis uh, subscribe. I'm Scarecrow J, and once again, thanks for watching.